Today, I will show you how to fix Apex Legends crossplay friends not showing problem. Let's get started. This video consists of one solution, and our solution involves a few steps. This solution was shared on Reddit and has worked for many people. I hope it helps you too. The first thing you need to do is press the escape key. After doing this, click return to main menu or press the R key. Then click yes to proceed. We are back at the main menu. Here, we need to press the tab key to change the data centers. The key to solving this problem is selecting a different data center. We choose a different data center. After doing this, click continue. There will be a small reload, but it won't take long. As you can see, the lobby has reloaded. You can press escape to check if the data center has changed. As you can see, we have changed the data center. Now. What we need to do is click ready, but not enter the game. We wait a bit, then click cancel. Here, we shouldn't join the match. We only need to queue. That's all we have to do. Nothing more is required. We will switch the data center back to its original. To do this, press escape key again and return to main menu. Once back, press tab and switch back to data center you normally use. This setup is important. If we don't do this, we will end up playing with high ping. We have switched the original data center. Now, click continue again. Like before, there will be a short waiting period, but it won't take too long. You might encounter the unable to connect error. If so, just click retry. You may not get this error at all, but I have shown you what to do if it happens. This way, we are back in the lobby. Now, press escape and check if the data center has changed. As you can see, we change the data center back. Now, press F2 and wait for the friend list to reload. The waiting time here should be about a minute. It could take a bit longer. After a minute passes, you should be able to see your cross-platform friends listed here. If this doesn't work, try restart the game. We have come to the end of the video. I hope this solution was useful for you. If the video helped you, don't forget to like the video. You can also subscribe to my channel to support me. Take care and see you in the next video.